VMware snapshots can be a burden on VM performance, and it can take considerable effort to overcome this challenge and meet SLAs. You need the ability to take backups of your VMs with zero impact, but that's just one piece of the puzzle. You also need to be able to recover directly from snapshots and leverage snapshots for a number of testing scenarios without impacting production performance. With Veeam Backup from Storage Snapshots, Veeam Explorer for Storage Snapshots, and Veeam's On Demand Sandbox for Storage Snapshots, you can accomplish these goals. And thanks to Veeam's Universal Storage API, you can do this all with the world's leading storage providers. Let's take a closer look at how this works. Before utilizing Backup from Storage Snapshots, we need to add our storage array to our Veeam Backup and Replication server. We can do this from the Veeam Backup and Replication console. The only thing we need to know is the name and the credentials for our storage array. Veeam Backup and Replication will take care of the rest. Adding a storage array to Veeam Backup Replication is an extremely simple wizard-based process, and Veeam supports multiple arrays from the world's leading storage providers. Veeam is continuously developing more partnerships on a frequent basis thanks to our Universal Storage API. We're talking about backup speeds up to 50 times faster than with competitive solutions when we leverage storage integration with Veeam Backup from Storage Snapshots. Now that we have added a storage array, we can browse the storage system and see the volumes on it. Let's face it, backing up during production hours has always been a challenge because it impacts the performance of production. Backup from Storage Snapshot improves RPOs by providing the ability to take a backup of critical systems more frequently anytime throughout the day with zero impact to virtual machines. Configuring a job to use backup from storage snapshots couldn't be easier. We just need to create a Veeam backup job. Here, we're gonna first name our job and then add our virtual machines. In this case, I'm gonna add virtual machines based on VMware vSphere tags. If we click on the advanced button when we are on the storage step of the new backup job wizard, we'll see an integration tab in the advanced setting windows. See how Enable Backup from Storage Snapshots is already checked? Veeam Backup and Replication is smart enough to know that we are backing up virtual machines on the storage array we have just added. This built-in integration improves the backup process with your chosen production storage by leveraging the storage integration snapshot functionality to reduce the impact on the environment from VMware vSphere snapshot removal during backup and replication. Creating a Veeam backup job using backup from storage snapshots is no different than any other Veeam backup and replication job. After our backup from storage snapshot job is completed, we can then restore directly from our storage snapshots with Veeam Explorer for storage snapshots. After all, what's backup without recovery? We don't always have the luxury of time for critical recoveries. If the CEO needs an email or a spreadsheet before a meeting, you need a fast way to recover this data. Veeam Explorer for storage snapshots can help. We can browse our storage snapshots right from the Veeam Backup and Replication console, and we have the ability to recover our data a number of different ways. Let's perform an instant VM restore. We simply right-click a VM and select the snapshot we'd like to restore from. Then we can restore from the same location or someplace completely different. We simply need to select the virtualization host we would like to recover to, and we can even give our virtual machine a new name. Once we hit the Restore button, Veeam Backup and Replication will do the hard work for us. Leveraging storage snapshots dramatically accelerates restores and eliminates the need to perform manual procedures. As you can see, the storage snapshot is cloned and mounted into VMware vSphere, and then the virtual machine is started from the storage snapshot. You can also leverage the data sitting idle in your storage snapshots with On Demand Sandbox, a part of Veeam Data Labs. This allows us to start up identical copies of production VMs in an isolated environment directly from our storage snapshots. We can put our data to work by doing things like testing and troubleshooting, all without impacting our production environment. Thanks for learning more about Veeam's backup from storage snapshot integration. Download a free 30-day trial of Veeam Availability Suite to get started today.